now? It's a great thrill. So 2001, we won the last one, and um, I mean to come off a World Series winning and, and then to cap it off winning a World Cup is a tremendous season for us, and, and great to do it with the core cool guys that I had here today as well. Before we left our shores, we uh, we had Eric Rush and Jonah Loma come in, and they were part of our uh, squad that we won in 2001. Eric Rush was my captain, and Jonah, of course, was was quite influential in that result. And um, they talked about a buzzword and getting the buzz going. And we struggled here in the first two days, but that third day today, every game from Wales to Fiji to, to England, we played superbly. And uh, just so proud of the players, the way they performed. What was the key difference on day three? Oh, just an attitude, really. You know, it's um, we had a pretty tough draw when you looked at the side of the draw we're on today as well. And uh, we just uh, really just one game at a time for us today. And it was quarter final, and um, Fiji was a big one for us. We knew we'd be up against it. Quite disruptive as well with the weather. And then to, to play well in the conditions. And probably what was most pleasing was the way that we stuck to the game plan to beat England. And uh, comprehensively, they played right into our hands, and we knew they would, so it was good. Got uh, three tries on the ball board early in the first half, which really set up that match. Yeah, good tries in the conditions as well. And uh, I just couldn't believe my luck when they kept kicking it back to us, you know, because we had that covered. We thought they'd use their pace men. But uh, we played a bit of footy in the weather as well and scored some good tries, you know, and uh, which was great for the crowd. And uh, it might have been a bit of a kick feast, but uh, but uh, we had to kick at times. And we don't usually like kicking as a as an All Black Sevens team. I don't really like it, and uh, we very rarely do. But uh, today was all about winning a World Cup and playing the percentages and and playing the best footy. Gordon, it seemed like quite a special moment out there with, with DJ coming off. Oh, DJ Forbes, simply outstanding. It was one one trophy that he hadn't held. He's had a World Series trophies, of course, and a, and a Commonwealth Games gold medal, but uh, he wanted a World Cup, and it meant a lot to him, and I made sure he stayed on to the right to the end as well, which is uh, pleasing for DJ because uh, just such an inspirational leader, and he's done so much for, for New Zealand Sevens. Has to lay down a marker for the Olympics, uh, Yeah, it's a, it's a great marker. I suppose it's leverage. We've got a Com Games next year, but... Um, it just shows there's a lot of depth right throughout the world in, in sevens and you've seen all these other teams, even the United States went so close to beating us on, on the second day. So no, there's no easy games, and uh, but you never attack more than one game at a time. And what I was pleased about was the younger players that started to put their hand up, uh, they came off the bench, they provided you know, the impact they needed when they went on. And you know, Tomasi Tharma and that, you can never replace experience. Forbes, Mickelson, Tharma, Rakanbula, you need that to bring the younger players through, and it was awesome to see that happen, especially in this tournament. Looking ahead, you've got a good young crop of players at home now. The, the next World Series is also looking promising. Yeah, it is looking promising, you know, but uh, we're still always looking to build more depth, you know, because it's going to become even more and more competitive. And uh, I mean, it's a great spectator sport, isn't it? Globally, it's just getting bigger and bigger, and it's. Uh, I just can't wait to, to get my hands on the next couple of players, and there'll be some coming out of the under-20s that have just competed just recently. So uh, what you've seen what South Africa can do, they've got some, some fantastic quick players in there as well, and they'll be coming through, so it's, it's getting tougher, not easier, I can assure you.